Hey, what's up, guys? It's your one and only favorite YouTuber, Mike's Douche Flutes 101, but, uh, God, I need to change that name. <laughs> uh, today is gonna be not a vape review, obviously. Um, I'm sorry, I smoked some shit and I feel a little out. Um, I want to talk about some of the smokable herbs, like the last video I did. It was a herbal blend. Um, I want to talk about one herb in particular that really needs to get talked about and really needs to get out there because I see a lot of videos on YouTube. Uh, a lot of people having experiences with mugworts, uh, Damiana, I believe Mullen, and some other herbs, but they never talk about smoking skullcap. This is the name of it. I got it off Earth Gifts. It's a little store here in Florida. Um, yeah, so it's uh, Growing USA Sifted, certified organic. I mean, it's, you know, it's got their number and shit down here. If, I don't think so you can order from them. I don't know. It's the only store pickup, so. Uh, it's a little baggy I got it from them. And, uh, Literally, it's just, like, leaves and shit. I don't know if you can, the camera will focus on that. Literally leaves, alright? Um, so this stuff, let me tell you effects. You can both drink it in a tea, you can smoke it. You can create edibles, don't give a shit, and this is perfectly legal in all states in the United States. I don't know if it's legal in other countries, but, um, so the effects of smoking this herb, and I, I took a pull off of it just once. God damn, it feels nice. Um, so straight up, when smoking anything, it will raise your uh, heartbeat. Uh, it does to me and pretty much everyone else. Um, don't panic if you haven't smoked before. And uh, there's no reason for you to start smoking. But if you want to try it, go ahead. You, I mean, it's your choice. Like it is mine. I have perfect good reason for me smoking that shit. Anyways, uh, the best effects of smoking Skullcap. It's a sedative, all right? It's a mild to a medium type-ish sedative. Depends how much of it you smoke, drink, eat, don't give a shit. Um, like me, I have a little glass bowl here and I have skull cap on the top. I have some mullen on the bottom. Mullen just burns good and I like the flavor and shit. So, um, so it's a sedative. Uh, it'll give you like a mild euphoria, but the best part is it gives you a sense of uh, like a high, like a like a THC high, but it's very mild. Um, if you smoke it a lot, you will get baked. Uh, just letting you know. And I had a pretty bad experience with it because <laughs> I'm stupid. But uh, I had my little tobacco pipe um, and I stuffed about four bowls of that shit in there and I kept puffing it like a choo-choo train, and then that last bowl, the last fourth bowl, I just freaking went for it, I just lit it up, and just direct long like I've hit my vapes, and I'm like, oh, shit, why the fuck did I just do that, and then all of a sudden, like, my heart rate picks up, go, like, like, so fucking fast, I'm like, oh, shit, just don't panic, and I start panicking, and by far the worst fucking feeling you can have it's like it's like you're about to die but you're not and you just like just erratic just bad but i managed to calm myself down drink a whole bottle of water i just laid in my bed gave it like 10 minutes and the heart rate slowed down and then i felt really baked um like all my arms and nerves were so numb I literally couldn't pick it up. I couldn't move. Like, it wasn't a bad couldn't move, but, like, felt really fucking good. Um, 
what else is Skullcap used for? You can drink it as a tea, and there's different variants of Skullcap. Um, there's like an Asian one where it's like an antibacterial, anti-inflammatory, all that stuff. But literally all Skullcap can do that. But different strains are more effective in their own fields and shit. So, yeah. I'm going to smoke some right now. I already took one hit before. And I feel calm and relaxed. Um, here goes. Since I'm a lightweight, I'm not going to hit it anymore. <laughs> There's a good reason. Um, it affects me a lot quicker. Um, just like that. Oh, my God. That was a big hit. <laughs> that was a big fucking hit. Oh shit. I literally feel it in my feet, like so relaxed. Wow. And um <laughs> Damn, I don't wanna get up. <laughs> wow. second here. <laughs> that shit hit me hard. Wow, it, this this does not hit like my tobacco pipe. Tobacco pipe takes a little while to, you know, get it through and in and the hole is like really tight but this this bowl oh my god it's like so fast that's a, such a big hit and it's just little pinch of skull cap in there <clears throat> and mullen but wow um i feel relaxed i feel that sedation effect to it oh man the euphoria is so good and it's like a little hit i was like that's the biggest hit right there, but oh my god. Now, if you're not a lightweight like me and don't get easily baked, <laughs> um, yeah, you might need like two or three bowls of this stuff to feel what I'm feeling. But like I said, I don't smoke a lot and uh Fuck it. Number one thing, drink a lot of water, vaping or smoking. Mm. Now, <clears throat> don't go ahead and start smoking this. Uh, some people might get allergic reactions to skull cap. Me, I'm lucky I don't. And I drink a lot of teas, and there's like, uh, it's like, there's a name for it, I forget the name. Uh, but like, if you don't 
if you're allergic to drink like chamomile tea or like other herbal like really herbal blends um i'm recommending smoking this or drinking it or just letting you know so just make sure you're not allergic to it somehow <clears throat> drink a little bit of it smoke a little bit of it see how you feel um but I'm baked as fuck. I can't think. Like, it's so relaxing. And it's a big sleep aid. If you haven't tried this, like, before you go to bed to sleep, like, 30 minutes before, smoke it. And just relax. And then go to sleep. I shit you not, your dream's gonna be so fucking good. Oh yeah, um, I read, I read something about when you smoke. Thank fuck. I'm sedated as a motherfucker right now. That's how I feel right now. Shorty from Scary Movie. Uh, what was I saying? Uh, yeah, there's this forum or some shit I read about online uh, saying that there's two different highs. There's a head high and then there's a body high. And it's something to do with your heart rate. Let me try and remember. Uh, I think when your heartbeat is rapid, uh, you're getting the head high. And if your heartbeat is slow as fuck like mine is right now, you're getting the body high. But. I sense the body high. And, uh, a head high. Holy <laughs> my hands oh they're so weird oh shit what the fuck no way I, I never experienced this before okay so this shit really fucked me up <laughs> Oh, damn. I'm so relaxed. Okay, um... <laughs> what am I feeling right now? Uh... Calm. Very, very calm. Sedated as fuck, best two. 
And I feel a bit sleepy, but that's because what happens when you're baked? Oh shit. I don't want to get up. That's one thing. That's because I can't. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> All of a sudden, I'm laughing. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> wow. It's by far I just want to go to sleep. This is by far the best experience I've ever had smoking skull cap. I think maybe it's because I had a little bit of mullen in there. Maybe the mullen did something too because it helps you relax. Another thing is uh, about skull cap. Um, the highs, <clears throat> the highs don't last that long. Since I only took like what, three, four, pull it, three, four hits. And I did one off video. And when I did one off video, I just wanted to make a video about skull cap. Shit. Yeah, this shit wants I just want to go to sleep on it. And the only reason because I want to go to sleep on it is because I'm on my bed, I'm baked. <laughs> wow, like uh like the thing I did with the hand, it's gone now, but like my hand was going like slow motion, like do 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 it's like the effects were like falling it and shit. Um I think it has a mild uh, psycho effect to it. It makes you maybe hallucinate a little bit. That's what mugworts is. Mugworts would do that to you if you smoke too much of it. You'll start seeing shit. And I think that's to do with your like higher self and shit like that. Um, just letting you know, uh, you will never get an effect like this. If you smoke mugworts, that shit only relaxes you. And to get the psychoeffective effects, you have to drink the tea. Best thing about Skullcap is, if you have the flu or you're sick with something, put at least one or two grams of that shit in some boiling hot water and let it steep for 15 minutes. Wait for it to cool, preferably put honey in it. And uh, just drink it. The sedation effect will be greater than what I just did smoking. Okay. The effects are slowly wearing out. <clears throat> but uh, like the euphoria is still present. Um, the high is wearing off. God damn, I got really baked. The thing that is still staying and will stay for maybe an hour or two is <clears throat> the sedation effect. Um, as in my nerves and hands. I really like, I, I want to move my fingers, but it's like, nah, just let it chill, dude that kind of effect um like if you had pain anywhere in your body <clears throat> this will make it go away and uh yeah 
this. You can forget about CBD. You will never get an effect like this off CBD. The effects I'm getting right now is really close to uh, marijuana. I'd say it's like a indica. I forget which one. Sativa is the one that relaxes you. Indica is the one that makes you like a little hyper. Or, or I got it mixed up because I still can't really think right now. <laughs> um, all right, so the high is off, completely worn out. Like, maybe it's still there a little bit, but, um, wow, that was a trip. That was pretty crazy. Um, I still feel relaxed, like, my face and stuff is a little tingly, and my hands are, like, numbish, loose, and I have no pain. Like. So yeah, guys, that's uh, skull cap for you. Um, I would highly recommend this stuff if you are uh, in pain or you need something to relax. This is the stuff to go, and possibly the best way to smoke it is by itself. The flavor is not terrible. Uh, it's like earthy herbal. Uh, Smells like weed when you burn it. Tastes like not weed. I'd say almost close to a cigarette, but not a cigarette. It's complicated. You try it yourself and you let me know. But, um, wow. Okay, I'm starting to think clearly now. <laughs> oh, shit. Wow, okay. Um, I'm back to myself now. Wow. But, like, my hands and stuff is still, like, you know, numb, sedated effect. Um, that was a experience I haven't had before on this stuff. I had other experiences which just numbs me up, but I didn't get that fucked up. Wow. And that was just like, what, three or four hits. And the hits I was doing on camera were pretty big. Uh, probably that's why. But, um... Yeah, guys, I'll, I'll be making more videos about herbs, and um, I don't know when I'm going to be doing all the vaping stuff. The vaping stuff, I don't know, it's probably getting old. Uh, what do you guys think? I can do some crazy builds on the RDA, but I just don't feel like doing anything vape-related yet. Um, what else? Yeah, I got more herbs to test out and smoke by itself and give you my effects. Wow. That's a wonderful herb skull cap. Best shit. All my herbal blends contain this. The people that I sell to, they they get really fucked. Um, so yeah, um, thanks for watching and uh, stay tuned.